What's going on people and welcome back to AJ Cars and welcome back to another video on the M140 and you've read the title, yes, today we are putting CSL parts. We're going to do a transformation, we're going to make it look a bit different, but we need to do a few things before we do that, so let's get straight into the video. Right, so first plan of action, I hate these. I need these off, so, I mean, I don't know, I mean, look at that. I don't know how well this is gonna come off because these have been on there for a while, clearly. So I need to start with getting these off. Once I've got these off, then I can attempt to heat these, and if they don't come off, we're gonna be here for a while. A long, long, long time, <laughs> because, oh, that's just gonna be awful. Yeah, it's not gonna be It's scrape them off, coffee wheel them off, or heat them if I'm lucky, so. Let's start with getting these side so extensions off. Oh, that's not going to be fun. It's not really fun. So, you know, when you get like a, a barcode on the back of something, and you bite it. You yeah, and you off. peel it yeah. off, and then it just and breaks the shit there, comes up. And you start to like pick him. Oh, no, you're giving him nightmares. I might just fix this. Oh, this is going to be awful. Right, okay. Oh, for all them people that said, oh, you didn't clean it when you put it on, we're going to clean it today. <laughs> we're going to clean it because this is coming off. Including me, I did say this to him as well, so it's not just yeah. you guys in the comments. I got grilled enough, <laughs> so you can all share it. What's your time schedule assumption? How long do you think it's going to take to get the What, to get the sticker off? Yeah. I'm going to be optimistic and say half an hour. I knew you were going to say that. I knew you were going to say that. See, you're, you're a prick. Alex, you're now wrong. it's going to take us three hours. <laughs> what is <it? laughs> You've been living in Paris. Imagine, <laughs> you're immortalising a BMW garage. You've been put on a big picture on the wall. That being the view and that's your stance. <laughs> so what are we doing now, Alex? I like to heat it up first. Get as much heat in it as possible and then try and peel it off. Make it more malleable. If I like do it there and then peel it, that's cold so it'll just break. So I mean I'm being optimistic. Yeah, it should 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 make it easier to work with. Should be in the We're going to see the true colour of it now, aren't we? Yeah. If it does come off, we're going to see Alex hasn't it washed his car in a while, so we're going to have a. It's wet in England. A true contrast. It's wet, but my car's clean. It was wet. I did literally see it two days ago. I'm actually scared to see the colour of it, because that is dirty. White car. Oh, all the detailers are going to be cringing in the comments. Oh, it's gonna work. It's coming. Oh, look at that colour, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. To be fair, that, that's untouched paint. Are these OEM stickers? Uh, I think so, yeah. So that's that I paint. I don't know if they were put, well, they were put on very early in its life, I would imagine. Yeah, that's like perfect paint. You might need to like polish in the rest of the side skirts, you know, have like a clear contrast of scratches. I'm gonna, I'm gonna nah, I will, I'm gonna polish it. That's just filmed with a lot of confidence in this section of the video. I was really. What did you say? You said half an hour? Yeah. Should we get a timer in the corner? Look at that, man. It's all like wrap. It's like perfect wrap. You know, and it shrinks down. BMW quality. Oh, no. It's I, re it. I really thought you were going to pull it and like a little strip was going to come off. <laughs> Same. <laughs> I expected it just to go like this. Yeah. Did you go, oh, no. Or like a little tiny little strip would just rip all the way along. Oh my god. Oh yeah. What a blessing. Be careful where there's that little rip there. Oh, is it a curb? Previous owner. Oh, it's completely scratched. Look, it's peeling it. Yeah, it's that little. Oh, the whole side's got scratches, isn't it? Yeah, you see, you see it curb, I think. It must have sc oh, sc yeah. scraped along it. It wasn't me. 
You said half an hour, I said three hours. I reckon if we hit somewhere in between, like an hour, uh, an hour and a half, an hour and 45. Well, no, looking at this now, I don't want it to be three hours, I want it to be 20 minutes. I was going to say... Oh, no! We, oh, you need, what, we need to stop speaking. That's what we can't do. Hang on, what time is it? What time is it? Let's have a look. Let me check my phone. So it's currently 9.53. We started at what, 10 to? We'll say 10 to. So you guys will have a true accurate representation of how long this is taking us. I mean, I might be wrong. This always worked for me. If you're ever taking wrap off, you probably don't know. Always keep the panel hot. Yeah. That's why I'm keeping this on there. Just like, I'm just a bit low apprehensive. Heat. If you guys can see here, oh. there's quite a lot of cracking along the rear of the car. So we might run into some issues here, but so far, so good. Oh no. You might be better off starting here because we've got this little. Oh no, I'm gonna have to now. We'll rip now. We've got this little, like, little piece of it we got there. Oh, this cracking's actually gonna. Worry yeah, that's me. what I'm worried about. The hairdryer out. Real. Oh, look at that. Real. Oh. He's overlacing the sexual music. <laughs> bow, 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 bow. <laughs> <laughs> How many times is it the silver? It might need to put back on when you're about to scratch you. Mm -hmm. got some white touch on it. Yeah. 300 to the paint code, depending on what it's going to be. Alpine white. Mate, this seal is massive. I think having these off with the car clean and those extensions will change the look of it. The car will look a lot lower on the side, I think, as well. Yeah, 100%. I, just, I think this kind of kills it, to be fair. Yeah, I'm never, I've never been a fan I've, of it. I always thought they looked cheap. I like like, no offence, but like, they, it's that... It's the, the satin look. When everything else is gloss black and you've got like satin or like matte coloured... It's, it's like an M light mud. It, it looks cheap, yeah. I think. I'll clean up them bar pieces, don't worry. Don't worry. I mean, it's currently... 9.58, so what, like 10 minutes? 10 minutes with that. So, <laughs> that we should be on track for 20 minutes. Nah, can I go Look at the state of this seal. Honestly, this... Look at the install, what he... What's he done? Oh my god. What are you doing, man? You ruined it. There's just no lip on it. I might have to try and polish that. Try and get that off. I know so the detailers are going to be hating you in the comments. Oh my god, you're not you're using the, the proper paint. product. You didn't use a pre wash and decontamination we before doing that. So, what have we got here, Alex? Hard compound. Let's see if it's. Like butter. Honestly though, the size cuts are looking so nice without that sticker on. I think it looks cleaner. They look so much bigger as well. It looks so better. That looks so much better. <laughs> it's actually the same colour, which is good. It hasn't discoloured over the years. I mean, once you wash the full car as well. So much better. All you guys that moaned in the previous video, you can be happy now. You can be happy, don't moan at me. Underneath of the car has been cleaned. Leave me alone. We're nice Look person. at the tricep there, AJ cars. You've been, you've been going gym, gym. Nah, mate, I like Mackies. <laughs> oh, once that whole car's clean, it's going to change it so much. 
We can't clean it just yet because we have, we other, have parts uh, to other parts. There's a small self tapper. Oh, screw it. It's a self tapper. That is not what I'm doing. <laughs> Eight mils only, being the view approved. Solid skirt, seal extension, stickers, whatever the hell you want to call it. M Sport, <laughs> absolute ugly things are off. I'm going to start it out, actually. We can't do that like that. <laughs> right, now. We need to get the front bumper off because if you ever saw the channel when I had the Golf, you'll know I had Magna plates on the Golf. And that is what we're doing with this as well. And I'm putting my reg back on. This is just another step to making this look a little bit better before we put the CSL parts on. So, bumper off, Magna plates on the back of it. Let's go. Well, for those of you who don't know, this is how you get a bumper off. Eight mil there. 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 Same underneath, all eight mils and then replicate the other side. Pop the bonnet and there's a 25 torques on the headlight and a 25 torques on the other headlight and then the rest are just 30 torques. Pull it off, unplug anything you need to unplug if they do have sensors, mine doesn't because I'm a POV spec. Let me get a filthy out. Should have cleaned the car before. <laughs> I should have actually cleaned it before. Huh? They say to take the arch guard out, I never do. Because on his own car, on BMW cars, he definitely does. You don't need to. People <laughs> say you just pull them back and you can just. They're like, oh no, it bends them, it doesn't bend them, they just pop them right back. It's in. an arch liner anyway. We never ran arch liners on the golfs. Too low. Oh yeah, we never had arch liners. <laughs> I, oh no, I, I think I had half a rear one. I didn't have any. I had half a rear for when I Oh no, I, I had the rear for my, on the bumper side, yeah. That was just. <laughs> just get us full of stone chip otherwise. Yeah, because I couldn't air out. Like the front. Yeah. Because it was so low, it burnt all the arch lining, so it literally just completely wrote it off. I was driving the once, I just had it go, it just like ate itself up. That arch line is in perfect condition, no issues. Eight mils underneath. To be honest, I'm actually shocked that all of these bolts are in. Oh, am I going to get to them ones? You're going to take the splitter off. Oh no, <laughs> it takes so long. <laughs> AJ Carr's pit crew. Mate, good job I didn't bond that splitter on. I wish I had thought about that before. Why was that not, fella? So you work at Formula 1 at Alex. Take your splitter off in about 10 seconds. Ah, see, I'm smart. Right? You, you 3 m it a little bit, didn't you? Yeah, I put a little... See, if you guys would have watched the video, you would have known that. I will ensure that Alex cleans this car properly before this goes back on the road. As you guys love to at him in the comments for not cleaning it. What? <laughs> not cleaning your car. Like it's under the, it's literally under a rubber. No, you should be removing the rubbers, full detail. What they call like a concourse detail. <laughs> As easy as that. This was the other way to change these, but why would anyone want to do that? Yeah, you if you saw the video, you know you can just pop those grills out in about 10 seconds and put those on. Right. But why on earth would you go for well, all the fat? I wanted to see you on here in case it's had a whack, it hasn't though, which is good. Where'd you buy this car from? Has <coughs> it been with a B? <laughs> Co part. <laughs> yeah. It's a really difficult part. Yes. Very oh. <sighs> There's so long. Why do people do it? Why can't anything be simple? First, you've got bolts. Oh, that's should, good. Should be illegal anyway. Oh. Oh, no. You've got the gun still. Just don't, don't make it paint. Just use the gun. 
Mate, use the gun. Please. What do you mean use the gun? Heat gun. Look. Don't want to rip your paint. Please use the heat gun. <laughs> I don't want you to rip a fucking section of your paint off. Why is that even? I mean, Jesus Christ. No, that heat's not doing anything. Nothing simple, is it? Oh my god, mate. Why? What's the point in that? Have you ever owned this car before, Alex? What were you thinking? You already had screws in there? Why do you have tape, Velcro, and screws? <laughs> Tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna leave that for now. We'll let that, let that soak and get onto. And we'll move on to the CSL. The more interesting part of the video. CSL parts. Now, CSL parts. If you haven't already guessed. Headlights. We are going to be putting yellow DRLs in this. Now, these can be a pain, like a big pain. Are they similar to the G80s? Can you just change the module? It's one of the modules, but I don't know which module it is. I don't know if it's this one or not. Or it's that one in there. It's usually a ballistic one. I know, it's both of them, isn't it? It's both of these. It's daytime running lights, so it's one for that. I've, not, one for I've not seen them much on the 140s, to be honest. It is, yeah. It's going to be that, because that focus on that yeah, side. I've, I've only seen them on G80s and stuff. So we're going to have to get these headlights out. Which is going to be a bit So I think, take the arch actually. <laughs> we're actually going to have to take the arch out now. <laughs> that's usually what that's for, to access the back of the headlight. You've got another one deep inside there, right there, and then you've got <laughs> this one here. And I think there's a ten mil back here. I'll double check. And it's been. I hate these clips. Uh, these are the worst, man. Why did they, why, who invented that? Whatever it was. Absolute idiot. So what we gotta do now, now that's spinning, for the viewers at home. Stress out for the next hour. <laughs> Cause now, the thing is, the only way you can do it is that, it's that little square block. Yeah, you gotta hold, hold it, yeah. That little square block, you need to hold it. Pass me, pass me a grip, I'll hold it while you. You ain't gonna get on it, that's the problem. You can't get in there to get on it. I have got some spares. I've got smaller ones in the car. Is there anything? Oh, see, how are you getting sick? Wiggly, wiggly. So, instead of taking the headlights out, because that's going to be an absolute nightmare, <laughs> I'm going to try. These are 20 torques. As long as I can get into these which i think i will be able to and then the same in there i reckon i can get them out just drop them down and change them you can get under it back yeah, in. Yeah. yeah buddy well so if anyone's wondering you can do it without taking it like that. <laughs> give that a little pry down there i hope these are the right ones Oh, don't, don't, we don't need a repeat of the TV video. Nah, no, I'm sure it is. Got a bit. Got a bit. It is. Positive. I think. <laughs> Maybe. Alright, <laughs> let's get the other one out. I I'm so happy that's come out, you know. Oh, yeah. It's coming. I don't know if you've got a weld them on. It's what? What? Be th thermal paste. So you don't need to solder it? No, no not usually with the um, motherboard. Is that like an alternative to solder? No, no, so say like when I built my PC, you got the motherboard, you um, thermal... When I built my PC? Oh, yes. <laughs> it's basically just when the two um, sides contact, it allows the current to pass through or some shit, I yeah, think. Similar Something like that. Similar I might be wrong. Solder. Yeah, let us know in the comments. Yes, sir. Look at the, check the stance. In honour of Mr. BMW Motorsport. Yeah, get me. 
it makes you know which side's which. Oh, now one's got a bigger clip. Huh? Ah, yes, you can't miss them up. Very well spotted, Zach. So we've got uh, his paste. Yeah, solid. Heat sink plaster. Yep. And then we've got four modules. Yeah, so I assume your thermal paste on the back of that, and then it goes on to bolts into there. Yeah. This is gonna look tasty. Does it add a bit more character to you guys? Look, you look more modified. But it's not gonna in a, look a CSL, bro. Not in a tacky way. It's gonna look like a CSL. They're gonna see me and they're gonna go, wow, is that an M4 that CSL? M140 oh CSL. God, no, it's a 140. There you go. What's the pace for? On the back of that. Yeah. I'd assume it is. It needs to conduct somehow. How though they were exactly the same? Yeah, but maybe because it's aftermarket, it might need it, I don't know. I'd, I'd put a dab on just just to be sure. What you reckon? Just stick it on the back. Just a little bit on the back of it. Yeah, nothing crazy because yeah. it's only a tiny little thing. But Good catch. Spotted Last spotted video we had the fly. Now we got the cab. <laughs> God, a bad Oh, it's like Tipex. <laughs> so you're saying which one was the thing? That one. Yeah, the thicker one. A little bit like that. But <laughs> you reinstall the old one. Yeah, that, that, yeah, that's... Yeah? That, yeah. That's gonna... Uh, I'd maybe spread it a little bit with your finger, I don't know. A bit grubby. Oh, it's grubby, man. It's because of work. I'm, I do I do wash, I promise. No, Alex washes once a month. You son his car. Doesn't wash that, doesn't wash himself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking your word for it on that, brother. If this blows up, I'm blaming you. I'll take blame. All your fault. I'm joking, I would never blame you. <laughs> ne ah! Next video, I kill my best friend. <laughs> my best friend dies from ruining my guy. <laughs> is that it? I, I mean, if that's it, that is beautiful. I'd, I'd do both before we. Can we test one no, first? I'm going to test one before. Yeah. Because it's that, it's them LEDs there. See that? That's, so you've quite that's what causes the light. So it. Yeah. Retract, it refracts from that and they're obviously different so the previous ones they're white yeah. or clear so if you, if you used to put a light on that you would see it so technically you could probably change that to any colour you wanted if you just change that yeah that's how you, if you see them they've got yeah. like see purple ones red, red yeah. purple blue you've got a lot the fact that we've done this like tagging the headlights out is that's astonishing I don't speak too soon we haven't done it yet but it's the same process in reverse of reinstalling it so Drop a screw in there, so it's closed. Drop a screw. What's your predictions? Yeah. All right, I don't see why it wouldn't. You leave your predictions unplugged it and plug the same thing back in, essentially. Was the other side on? That side, that side was on fine, yeah. I like how simple that is, man. The right one. Yeah. Wait, so you don't want the yellow ones? No, they're the original ones. Yeah, they're the stock ones, okay. I hope. <laughs> You're thinking about it now. Open the other pack. You f oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Alvin muddled that up. So. If you guys can see, we've got the other pack for the other side here. Why need it? Look what colour the little modules are. And look at the colour of the ones that we put back on the car. Oh shit, I've pasted that on. Yeah, Alex has pasted the stock one back on. Mate, I need to get that off and done. Yeah. ASAP. ASAP rocket. Should put one on with paste, one on without. Let's see what it does. I can do. Well, this one we won't put paste on. And we'll, we'll take, take that, that one, one off. And put the, <laughs> the correct one on. <laughs> I'm not the original. One. <laughs> Just seen a thought go through your head when I asked that question. You realise that they were yellow and we're supposed to have yellow DRLs. I don't know if it's because they're yellow or not. I don't know. Well, the new packet's got yellow, so it's going to be that. Because obviously these are for the other side, so the stock ones will be the white ones. 
We literally had the conversation about the light refracting Honestly, and it like, being the colour. The way my brain works, it needs to be studied, man, because I get told quite a lot that my brain don't work properly. Both are plugged in. Yeah. Yeah, it just needs them both plugged in. Oh, yeah. I can't really see. Let me. Oh. That is greasy. I tried to put the right ones in this time. <laughs> We're going to put the right ones in this time. We're going to put the right ones in. I promise. Heat wrap. Oh. Yeah, I've got the other one. I hope that heat thing hasn't gone off. Paste on, which I don't actually know what this is for, but I'm assuming it's to, it's like a heat resistant thing. And I don't want to risk anything. So that's going on there. Right, two originals. Right, we've got both of them. Both done. Now it's time, oh, I need to do the other side. I keep on forgetting about the other side. <laughs> right, let's get these in. Oh, and then we'll work on the other side. Let's go. Right, so that is them done. They're both in. I'm not going to turn it on just yet because I do want to go straight onto the other side. Zach is done that beautifully. Flat that down, that'll look perfect. Right, onto the next light and then the reveal. Right, headlights. CRL's fitted. I hope I've done this right. Yeah, moment of truth. Oh, that looks mean. Oh, yeah! Woo! That looks aggressive. That looks sick. But they're bright as well. Yeah, oh, really oh, bright. Like Imagine my angel eyes and yours at the night time. That looks aggressive, right? Look. This is not a bar, Oh, actually, I got one, Yeah. Split the rod, when that's clean, that'll look mean. It's aggressive, that does. Not that I run them anyway. Oh, yeah. uh, Jesus Christ, they are the strongest magnets in the world. Plus tape. <laughs> tape under. Oh my god! Do you want me to do it? <laughs> Bro! You're a gym lad, mate. You need to do this. So strong, That's it, yeah. I'll do it. Oh. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Straight away, it's going to be Arnold Swartz in it. No, they are literally bonded together. Oh, you're making a fool out of yourself. That's probably pretty good. Alright, I'll give it a little bit. Line up to where it needs to be. There. In the middle. You can just get your magnets. There we go. Boom. So essentially, they line up exactly. So that should Where hold the pads them. are on the other side. Now it's holding. Can mark them up. That we don't even need to do it. Yeah, as the other ones are tied down, yeah. uh, the magnets are down, just flip them over. We're so smart. No, I mean, that's probably the way you're supposed to do it. To be like. No, smart. We weren't smart about no, it. No, no. We, we, whoever invented it was smart. False confidence. Yeah, we, we're just doing what we're supposed to do. We haven't done anything differently. <laughs> we've done it exactly correct. Yeah, which means I'll tell you what, we have done a cheat code the headlights. Yeah. That is full programming. Look at that bad boy. Look how cool we now are. Oh. It's so cool. Look at that. Front. Yeah, you go. Everything. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow, I could have been so much better off in life if I didn't get into that. 
Yeah. <laughs> but also, if this YouTube stuff takes off, we could be thinking, I'm so glad <laughs> I got into cars. That all depends on the viewers. Right now, this is not a financially <laughs> good thing to do. Not we, good for the we do it. We do it for the passion because we enjoy cars. But it would help if we were getting paid to do it. As well. <laughs> yeah. Help us, Alex. Yeah. What? <laughs> Get it on. <laughs> back on track, back on track. Like it never happened, just cut that bit out. Yeah, definitely. Just start from there. Sorry guys, we're back. <laughs> I think that's all. Splitter. I hate three piece splitters. Well, look, sorry, I'm not rich and I couldn't buy a really expensive splitter. I'm just not that guy, bro. No, what, what you mean to say is, if anyone would like to sponsor me for a really clean, nice one piece splitter. Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> Mate, there's so many. How many splitters have been on this car, man? <laughs> Look, I can't. I don't even know what holes are mine. Oh, my splitters gonna fall apart, isn't it? You have to hold it. Don't. <laughs> <one. laughs> Come on, Alex. Come on, Alex. Oh, I found my hole. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? That's better. Money to the top. All right, let's get it down. Get it up the ramp. Cheers, Jeff. Which colour is that in with? Freaking hole on there. Is that to, to know exactly what the middle is? The middle of the bumper, which yeah. is already marked. You know, the groove part. <laughs> you know, yeah, that's the middle. White lines. Is that acceptable? Looks good to me. Looks good to you. Well, we're going to clean it first, aren't we, Sean? You're going to clean it. Okay, you need to move your car. You're not going to get it out. Clean. And then we're going to show. So, the moment we've all been waiting for, the car looks absolutely incredible. We've just cleaned it. Don't forget, we have done magnet plates on the front, so it has no reg on the front now. The side skirt, sticker things, they look awful, so they are now off. And we have the yellow CSL headlight mod. The yellow DRL, they look absolutely beautiful. Turn the camera around. Have it the yellow DRLs in my opinion absolutely changed that front and they look so so good I'm extremely happy with how they came out shout out to DC Prestige that's where I got these from they were very helpful they even messaged me on Instagram yeah that was a very easy install and they look so much better so thank you all so much for watching this video I'll see you guys in the next video peace